Winning can feel glamorous. This is our weight room. But life in the bubble is anything but. There's no getting out, moving around very much. We're pretty much secluded to this hotel. Some of my teammates, they're doing puzzles that we got in our little swag bag. The women's NCAA tournament is in San Antonio, but as the games continue, the disparity between the men's and women's tournaments continues to be the focus. On Monday, NCAA President Mark Emmert sent a letter to the institutions stating he will determine how they reached this disparity and that much has been resolved, according to ESPN. You really just don't have time to focus on it. Yeah, you have time to make a statement on it and have an opinion on it. But this is something that uh, women, women's athletics has been dealing with uh, since the NCAA took us over. Tuesday morning, Georgia Tech head coach Nell Fortner released a letter of her own on social media, thanking the NCAA for exposing how they feel about women's basketball as an afterthought. Young people just, <laughs> you know, they're, they're going to they're gonna not have it. I think it is something that needs to be addressed, and the NCAA should look into it and just see where they went wrong. It started with differences in the weight room, which the NCAA addressed. But Fortner called the NCAA's response a Band-Aid. Other disparities are apparent, from the food to accurate testing to the swag bags, even the courts. You know, that, that's something that needs to be addressed heavily um, when this tournament is over.